Welcome everyone back to another Boldcast Reaction. I'm Carson. I'm Lindsay. And this is Mob Psych 100, Season 2, Episode 6. Last, Last episode time was crazy. Was legitimately one of the best pieces of animation I've ever seen in my life. Like, that was one of the best episodes of anime ever. Like, one of the most artfully created episodes of any show I've seen. Incredible. I can't wait to see how they followed up. The season's been in just literally, it feels like a different show. It's like the quality was already so good. It went from an eight, eight out of 10 to like possibly a 10, if not a nine out of 10 mm -hmm. this season. So just so far, overall season, that's my general rating so far. So good. It, it was so good. I can't wait to see what happens this time. Hope you guys leave a like and subscribe. Check out Patreon. Link in the description to get at least a week ahead on the show. Mm -hmm. Possibly longer if you check out the uncut tier. Uh, uncut reactions are there obviously as well. Hope you enjoy most of all. Let's get into it. Four years ago. All right. Is that Reagan's last job? Oh, he was a salesman? Mm. You like the one computers and everything? Did he get fired or is he quitting? Or did he get promoted? <laughs> I remember this is him buying his own. <laughs> <laughs> this is a backstory episode? Damn. They had to take, take a little bit of a chill after last time. Yeah. Poor lonely whitey. <laughs> That's pretty good. 34? I couldn't do that. <laughs> I just love them. <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> I love how they all hang out together. Because <laughs> of the website, does he not yeah. like working that much? <laughs> what he should really start doing is like, oh, <laughs> nice birthday, <laughs> is make himself seem more exclusive and charge more and work less. Because he's already scamming people. So like, what, what's the problem with scamming them a little bit more effectively for himself? You know what I mean? You have a pretty good idea of what you mean. Why? Why are you being weird? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you keep it up for another six months, you'll be normal. <laughs> <laughs> no, I completely forgot about that. To mess around and hang out. Oh god. What if he was actually just so good? No. No! Don't go to work. No! He's really sticking up for himself. He's very assertive all of a sudden. Mm -hmm. No, he's not. You can't just... No. Really? Don't go. Don't go hang out with your friends. Ugh. It's such a shitty thing to do. That sucks. He needs to stop being such an asshole. Now go back and hang out. 
really upset. I wonder if he's going to find out that he's a scammer. It's me such an asshole. Is this for real? Is he trying to do something? Is he like pushing him away so that he'll grow up even more? On purpose? Or is he actually just being an asshole? That's just way too far. It seems like he's being serious. Yeah. Yeah. He's not even putting anything on. He was just being a fucking asshole. Yeah. He, sh he shouldn't? What do you mean he shouldn't have ever anyone else? He's saying like he doesn't, so like he's in no danger because he'll come back. Good move. Mm -hmm. だけじゃ良くないことに気づいて自分のやりたいことを考え直して。ナイス。いや。たまには not that there was many to begin with. You didn't play, you didn't pay him at, at all for anything. It's not gonna last very long. <laughs> he when thinks did, he's all... When did Reagan just become a fucking piece of shit? I mean, he was always a scam artist, obviously, but like, yeah. he was at least good to mob and like, seemingly wanted the best for him. I mean, the at the him, same he, time that he was taking advantage of He was of always, him. You, yes, he was obviously taking advantage of him. I thought like, the whole point was that there was like a duality there, but... Well, I think the problem is that he's he's just lying to himself right now. Yeah. He's all hyping it up like, oh, I'm so much better off. Mob's really struggling right now, even though, or not. Sure, which is why you're hiding. Why would he care? He's trying to convince him to go with him. Yeah. <laughs> he just wanted him to come and help him out. Is he gonna have to downgrade? Or no, that's just his apartment. Yeah. He's already downgraded. <laughs> You're the one with no friends, my dude. They want to take him to karaoke. Oh, they want to hang out with him. <laughs> Friend a book. It's like a scammer. <laughs> you have no friends. His birthday is October 10th. Oh. Is it mob? From mob. Oh, wait. What did that one say? Save me. Every song will leave my house. Perv master. Got a fresh batch of pervy <laughs> pictures for you. Now you can be a perv master. You're a fake. I'll curse you. Curse, curse, that curse. That one guy. 
spirit photo. I ended up taking one. Could you do something about it? Oh my fuck, you all these people again? Or maybe that's from before. Remember our neighbors, the Kobayashis? I heard their oldest son got married. Just last month, you should hurry up and find a secure job. You still have a chance. You're still only 28. If you want another chance at life, you should probably make a decision fast. Wow. That's kind of a shitty message. I think that's just Asian parents, if I understand correctly. That's a file. Is It's probably a potential partner. Oh, no. Even worse. Whitey recruitment. Oh, my God. That's perhaps the most depressing image in this whole show so far. <laughs> yeah. That reaction. Holy crap. <laughs> oh, but he doesn't really like it that much? <laughs> he should sing. あ、<笑><笑> <laughs> These guys don't care about you. They're so obsessed with their own problems. Pyramid scheme. So depressing. This is serious. Did the, the bartender ask like, should you be drinking? Did he say that? Did I remember? Do I remember yeah, he saying that? It. Is he like an alcoholic? Uh, it seems like crazy. he maybe used to hang out here a lot. Yeah. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> Holy shit. There wasn't even alcohol in it. It was all placebo all effect. Wow. No, it was all placebo effect, like exactly what he does to all his clients. Dude, that was like the most genius bit of writing I've ever fucking seen. <laughs> that was like, wow, that was good. Imagine if this guy, his bar actually had no alcohol whatsoever. I know it was probably just a, a thing, thing for, for this one time, but like... He must have been a, a, a recovering alcohol. Well, yeah, because that, that really happens if you if you think that there's alcohol in something. Like, you mm -hmm. can get drunk off of nothing. That's so fucking crazy. Genius writing. The fact that he, that's exactly what he does for a living and that he like just mm -hmm. fell for it immediately at his lowest point. Like, it's it says so much about his whole situation and who he is. Yeah. Yeah. What is it with bugs this season? Yeah. Oh no. Is he gonna take to the next step and like start a fucking religion or a cult? Like for real? Or is he just gonna try to be more of a regular person? I think he's going, he said he wanted to become someone. New. Wait, what? Oh my god. Wait, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. What is driving him here? Like what? <laughs> oh my god. Is this for something or is he actually trying to help people? Give me too many in game parties. Popularity person. <laughs> the bro? <laughs> he's doing it for popularity and then he's gonna cash in on it, I bet. 
レーゲン先生の噂をたまたま耳にうまく手入れ日常に芸能界の大物ですよあいいじいさん能力は実在するのかスペシャル生放送でお送りしてみたら森里ゲストに SF 学者モニタツヤさんいただきましたお座りよろしく俺テレビに出てるよとんとん拍子に盛り上がってる感じだ今悪い霊に取りつかれたという人物を Are they actually gonna be possessed? <laughs> That would be crazy. <laughs> if, he's a if this person's actually possessed, this guy can deal with him, though. Yeah, he's, he's replacing friends with just being popular. Yes. He's replacing making real life connections with just being a celebrity. Well, because all he's he's made it his business literally to be a liar, mm -hmm. and he so he can't connect with people. Like, yeah. He's trying to sabotage him? <laughs> well, yeah, you were possessed! But... That was actually a good thing. He helped you. I mean, he's he's being a piece of shit, but not to you. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't see why you have a grudge against him personally. Well, maybe if he's getting so popular, he's getting more jobs that that guy would normally get. Because I was guess, like but that's the... not what he said. He said he was pissed that he got <laughs> meat in the stomach. He wouldn't Ra even remember that. <laughs> Reagan is... Really taking a turn right now. I... Like, I legitimately is not expecting, like, I, the One Punch Man comparison, I, I, I don't, I, I don't like to keep making it because it, it feel at this point in the show, it feels like, it only, it only feels redundant, it feels pointless, it feels like I'm, I'm not comparing the, it feels like a, it feels like it's written by somebody else, because, mm -hmm. like, to make the comparison, I, my experience has been One Punch Man season one, the first volume, I think volume seven of One Punch Man, First volume of season two, and then uh, and then season one of Mob Psycho. To get into this season and to go where this story's going is so out of character from what I've seen so far from one. And I've only seen the introduction to both of his main series, so that, that says something, but mm -hmm. like he's very intelligent in just what I've seen and, and he writes things really intelligently and he, he, he takes things in interesting directions and is very, meta and very uh self-aware but also has a heart to his writing but uh i was not expecting the extremely daring approach that he's taking the, the like really taking the the characters far really like mm -hmm. actually dynamic characters with multiple dimensions and um you know size to them like reagan has shown so much color and so many different facets to the yeah. way that he interacts with everybody like even with just how he interacts with mob the fact that, yeah, he's he's been taking advantage of him, but it was kind of a playful thing, but he really did want to help Mob out, and he really did help him out, and he really does help people out. But I think the thing was, is that he didn't, like, he wanted to help him out, like... But he didn't but actually believe threatened. that he was capable. He liked being the one to guide yes. him and to help him. He didn't like it when it actually worked and he actually started doing things himself. And he didn't have himself. control over, yeah. And he, and he um, didn't have this person who like looked up to him like mm -hmm. like he was the smartest guy ever, his master, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera, and who made him money and did all this good shit. It's just like, what happens when he loses that? It turns out Mob is like the only person in his life, the only thing that he has. Mm -hmm. is is his job and the times that he spends with mom and, and, and mentoring him. And then he like him. tries to, so he takes it too far, he gets too comfortable basically just taking and advantage of this kid. And then tries to take him down. And then, yeah, then, so then mob, yeah, starts to do things on his own and then he's like, just beats him down. Yeah. For, this for his own game. This takes it way too far. Like with no regard for mob's when, feelings or his he, life. If they could have worked it out there. They could have said, okay, you wanna know what? That's totally fair. I'm so happy for you that you're doing stuff. Now, in his mind, only take uh, actual spirits on like weekends or something, and Mob can just work weekend. Like you know what I mean? There was, there, he didn't have to react like that. And if he didn't react like that, and if he didn't keep taking advantage of him, they it could have worked out just fine. They could have come to yeah, an agreement. Yeah, but it, it would have worked out for his job. But again, like you said, it's not just about his job. It's also about his ego and. Yeah. 
God, he's so it's such a fucking well written character. Like my goodness, and like I think it it, it stems. I think the maybe the reason why he doesn't want to make a compromise aside from that is like what we saw with this is just a, an interpretation, kind of random, but with what we saw in his backstory at the start of the episode with his job. Um, that he quit. He was like clearly working for like a call center or something, mm -hmm. like you know, tell uh, phone sales stuff like that. And he just quit. It didn't seem like he was fired. He quit and he, without any plan. He just like was. He seemed like he was probably just fucking sick of yeah. that life. Kind of similar to uh, to Saitama in a way, because Saitama mm -hmm. in the episode one, he's just like, uh, I'm gonna. He just quit his job, or he he can get a job. He was like. Uh, trying to get a job. He's going to all these interviews and then he fights the crab man and he just decides he's gonna not do anything and be a hero for fun. And then, uh, you know, th that's kind of it. And just kind of live off of this thing that he's mm -hmm. trying to do. And so the, the characters there are kind of similar. Uh, but it's, it's this thing of like, he wanted to escape this like life of compromises, life of like quiet desperation where he's just sort of it's very mundane. He has no mm -hmm. control over himself. At least here he has control over, over himself. But then once he doesn't have that control over his life and his own finances, then he's, he just is, or his ego gets out of whack. Like it, it, there's so much to him. It's, it's really surprising I me like like the, how this the series bar is scene as well, how he goes there. And it's just like, basically it seems like he used to just go there all the time and just feel better when comparing himself to these other people yeah. who were dumb and fell for scams his scams but then in this moment he like goes there like looking for something real whether he know he like goes there and is like oh yeah these i remember like this friends. yeah these guys these guys they all you know but then they don't actually the lady tries to sell him a fucking yeah. pillow it's 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 uh, it's it's not real and instead of being like holy shit this is messed up. I need to like. I think he did. He yeah, did. but instead of instead of t instead of taking that of like my life is messed up, I need to stop being an asshole and like you know make some friends. Instead, he's like, I need to really double down on what I'm doing and like get crazy popular and stuff like that. You know what I mean? He did. He didn't really take a step back, and he like took a step back and then went in like the exact wrong direction. Yeah. He doubled wow. down on all the things that were kind of bad for him. Him as a person, good for his career, but not good for him as a person. Great episode. Holy shit. There's so much, like, it, you know, the development is out of control this season. Mm -hmm. They really are. It's they're, they're going further than I ever expected. So I hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. Hope you guys leave a like and subscribe. We'll see you in the next one. I'm Carson. I'm Lindsay. Bye-bye.